Time for some fun with the kitchen pantry scientists, and looks like we've got cars ready. Yeah. We're ready to hit the raceway here. Cardboard cars. Liz Heineke joins us. Hey guys. Hey, this is really fun. It is fun. I've been testing out how to make rubber band cars um, using all different things I found on the internet, cool. and I have to tell you, a lot of them do not work very well. <laughs> sure. So you've done that work for us. I have. For example, this one with the propeller and rubber bands. This looks like it was a lot of work. For it you was a lot of work. I made it twice. It never worked. Oh. So didn't work. Throwing right. that one away. Out. This one. Simple to make. You make it out of cardboard. You need straws, cardboard. You need some wooden skewers, and that's okay. about it. So it's really okay. easy to make. It's cheap. And it works. It works. So right. you start right. basically. I'm just going to explain it, and they're going to, and then we're, we're going to run we're it across the table. All yeah. Right. Okay. So basically, you make a tube. You just roll some cardboard around some kind of a spice bottle or something, oh, right? Perfect. Yep. You tape it together. Then you make the wheels. So the wheels are just double. I doubled up. You trace a CD okay. onto oh, some cardboard. Yeah. Draw a square around it. Use a ruler to draw diagonal lines. That helps you find the center, right? Perfect. And then, see, this is all math for kids too, geometry, right? Sure. Oh, I love that. And then you can use skewers. You can use a compass. But basically, you're going to poke um, a skewer through it. That's going to be the wheel. Yeah. And I doubled it up to make it stronger, right? Awesome. This will all be on my website. OK. okay great. <laughs> So then you use some straws. I'm going to hold this up so you can see this. Okay. See how I have straws here? Yes. And these let the wheels roll, right? Mm -hmm. So you tape the wheels to the skewer. You tape the straws to the cardboard body. And then you put a skewer in the end, and this is what your rubber band attaches onto. See that? Oh, uh -huh, yes. I tied some rubber bands together. I dropped them through the center. I have this little pipe cleaner, you see? Yeah. That helped me pull them oh. through. But what you do then is you, and I'm probably going to mess this up. That's okay. But you kind of stick your hand down it. here. <laughs> yeah, if it doesn't work, it'll just be another time it doesn't work, right? <laughs> you stick your hand down here, you wind it up. Now, I'm going to talk about the science as I'm winding it up. So basically, my muscles are doing work on this car, right? Oh, so, okay, so you're winding. So I'm winding or I'm trying to. So is this mm -hmm. a kinetic energy yes. type situation? Oh, well done, Jason. Rush up. Yeah. So my, my muscles knowledge. are doing work on this rubber band. The rubber band's made of what? It's rubber. It's mm -hmm. got elastic, right? Yep. Okay, good. It's winding. Can you see that? Yeah. So I don't know if the cameras around. can see that. It's yep. Here, if we go like this, we might be able to oh, see. Oh, thank you. There you see, go. you guys are yep. so good with cameras. <laughs> 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 All right. So I'm winding it around. We're storing this energy that I'm using for my muscles as uh -huh. potential energy. It's right. Yep. It's elastic energy. So I'm going to set this down on the table. Let's see what you're. Okay, we're going to set it here, Kylie. All right. I'm going to let you let it go. Okay. And then. The Ready? elastic energy is going to turn into kinetic oh, energy. Oh, Woo! Oh, or the energy of motion. It, it can worked, run. It, worked. it can run all the way across the That's whole room. Fun. It's super fun. Oh, look, there it, it goes. Oh, it's still going. <laughs> <laughs> Just went across the studio floor. Yeah. All right, Go Jason's Jason. on it. <laughs> anyway, this is a great engineering project for yeah. kids too, because they can try building different size wheels on their car. Thank you, Jason. They can make different lengths of car. They can see if using fewer or more rubber bands, um, they can store more energy. The strength, and the they width, all of those different variables. All kinds of stuff. That's and fun. more importantly, and I haven't done this to this one yet, decorate the car. Yes. Right? For sure. For sure. I put a lot of glitter take, on there. Glitter, yeah. I've had glitter kids doing this good. project lately. Okay, you'll need the instructions, right? Liz has it all on her website, kitchenpantryscientist.com. Just go to wcco.com slash links. We'll get you there. Thanks, Liz. Awesome. This was cool. Thanks, you guys. Thank you.